So for those of you that are subscribed to my channel, first of all, thank you. And second of all, you'll know that I've covered mainly smartphones in all of the videos that I've done. I've done an iPad in one of them. So what I'm going to do is something a little bit different today. A couple of weeks ago, I was in the market for some speakers for my laptop. So after trolling through Amazon for a couple of weeks, deciding on some and then giving up, I decided on these. These are the Sanyan SW102 USB powered LED speakers for your laptop. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go through the design of these speakers, play a bit of audio samples from them, see what you think and let you know how much they cost. So here is one of the speakers set up on my laptop. So if we just quickly go through the build, as you can see here, plastic surrounding here, which is unsurprising, obviously. And then there's a plastic on the top, a red strip across the top there. And then of course your single speaker inside there. You can just, there we go, you can make it out in there. And then you've got a metal base with four rubber feet on the bottom, which obviously will help absorb vibrations. And then the blue LED underneath, which when you rest it down, it's lit up around the bottom there. So it's quite a nice design, nice and sturdy. There's no, there's no flex in any of it. When you're pushing in on, on this, there's no, there's no give on the mesh on the front. So it's a really nice, sturdy design. If I just bring the wire out a little bit, you've got an inline volume control there. I've got it set to max because I adjust the volume on my laptop, but of course you can set that to whatever you want. But I just sort of tuck that behind there. And then just to connect, obviously you've got a 3.5 millimeter jack, which goes into your slots on your laptop. And then you've got your USB-A cable and plug, which again goes into your laptop, which powers the speakers and the light. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna play a little bit of audio from a video that I've been working on, so you can see what it sounds like. There is a bit of music at the start of this video as well, so that will come through in a moment. But this is just going to be a quick side-by-side -side comparison, going through the specs, including the performance, the cameras, the build, and all that sort of stuff. So if you're interested, stick around, and if you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. So let's get to it. So going from left to right, I've got the Motorola G10. G30, G9. So as you can tell, I'm hoping that my camera has picked up the audio pretty well. The sound quality is actually really good coming from these speakers. Obviously you can tweak the individual settings on your laptop, the bass and the treble and all that sort of stuff, but I'm pretty happy with the quality of these speakers. Everything is crisp, the voices come out really well. Right, so price. Now, unless you've gone on Amazon, whilst you've been watching this video and spoiled it, then boo-hoo, you spoiled my fun. But $29.99 is the cost of these speakers, which I think for what you're getting, the quality of the build and the sounds and just the ease of setting them up is a really, really good price. So are they something I'd recommend? Definitely for a basic speaker setup, but obviously if you're more into your sound and all that sort of stuff, then of course, 30 quid, you're not going to be paying that for speakers. You're definitely going to go for something a bit more expensive and a bit better quality. But for me at this stage in my YouTube journey, they definitely do the job and I'm really happy with them. And I think for most people, you would be too. So I'll leave the link in the description if you want to look at buying these speakers. And thank you for watching. If you enjoy this sort of content, I will be hoping to bring more content that's not just smartphone related, so speakers, headphones, all stuff like that. And if there's anything in particular you want me to have a look at, let me know in the comments and I'll give it a go and try and get hold of them and do that. And subscribe to this channel if you like what you see. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.